Hello friends, in today's episode we look into 5 interesting gardening ideas and hacks on how to use cow dung or any animal manure for that matter. Questions like can I use fresh cow dung on my plants and few useful gardening hacks on using fresh cow dung as fertilizer, sun dried or dehydrated cow dung for plants and more coming up. Before we start, please make sure you have subscribed to our channel along with the bell notification so that you get notified whenever we add another useful episode. We all know that cow dung is one of the best organic natural fertilizer for plants. Cow manure is packed with quality major and minor nutrients required for plant growth that is NPK, nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium and many other trace elements. Roughly the NPK value of decomposed cow dung is 3, 2 and 1. Now, let's begin with our 5 interesting and useful gardening questions on the use of cow dung, horse dung or any animal manure. On number 5, can we use fresh cow dung on plants? This is the most important and commonly asked question on cow dung. Cow dung can be either fresh cow dung, then sun dried and dehydrated cow dung, then aged or partially decomposed cow dung and completely decomposed cow dung manure which is commercially sold by many companies like this one. We'll discuss on these one by one and by the end of the video you'll know which is best for your plants. Fresh cow poop should never be applied for your plants because it not only stinks but contains high levels of ammonia and salts which can burn your plants. It also contains harmful microorganisms like E. coli which are harmful to plants as well as humans. Plus, it also contains wheat seeds which can produce a lot of weeds that is unwanted plants in your garden. If you have fresh cow dung, you can use it in many ways and follow a few simple hacks that is on number 4. Convert fresh cow dung to aged cow dung. Yes, the next better option is to use an aged cow dung at least 6 months old. Simple hack is just dig a hole in your garden. Or if you do container gardening, take a large container with garden soil and dig a hole at least 4 to 6 inches deep and pour in the fresh cow dung or even sunburned cow dung and cover it with garden soil. Leave it for aging for at least 6 months. Then on number 3, another simple garden hack on using fresh cow dung or horse dung that is to dig a hole between two plants and bury the fresh cow dung at least 4 to 6 inches deep and this should not be in direct contact with roots. This way the manure becomes a gradual fertilizer around the plant and it is not in direct contact with the roots to burn the plant. The only drawback of this hack is it cannot be used in container gardening unless it's a large container. And one more thing, you can also use sun dried cow dung for this uh, hack. We'll talk about this next. That is on number 2, dehydrated cow dung. This in simple terms means dehydration, meaning removal of water from it. This is done in two ways, the desi method and the machine process method. The desi method is just sun dried for few days, that's it. This process of dehydration, especially the machine processed method which uses heat to dehydrate, reduces the harmful microbes and also ammonia and salt content to a certain extent. This dehydrated cow dung is lightweight and can be used on most plants but use it in smaller amounts or better avoid it for young plants and seedlings. Then on number 1, composted or fully decomposed cow dung. If you drop the cow dung into the process of composting, the final product what you get is the best and safe organic fertilizer for plants. When you compost cow manure, you get several benefits like the harmful ammonia is eliminated, the wheat seeds in the soil are destroyed and it also makes your soil well draining and well aerated. Plus, its moisture holding capacity is greatly improved. The only problem is it's a little bit expensive, especially if it's from a reliable company. This type of cow dung is the safe and best option for plants and can be applied either by mixing in the potting soil at about 20 to 30 percent proportion or it can also be applied once in a month on the top soil after raking or tilling the soil thoroughly. You can find links to purchase these online from the description below. You can also watch a detailed video on the goat or the sheep dung and 
how to use fresh goat dung from this end screen link circled right here. So there you have it folks, if you found this video helpful, please like, share and comment below with your feedback. Consider subscribing if you are new to the channel. Happy gardening!